And we're trash talking, talking a little trash. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Wednesday night, time to take out the trash. So anyway, I wanna thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, I hope that you take a quick second, hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. As you can see, my helping hand He's been designated to the corner. He seriously, he seriously misbehaved during my intro. So I had to shove him over there. I'll try to get some pictures and show you at the end if he lets me. So anyway, we are just going to take out the trash, do some empties here. I have a lot of stuff in here. I've got bags still because I just let it sit for so long. And then I just try to take a few at a time. And so you're going to probably see duplicates and things like that if I get to them in the same video here. So anyway, let's talk about talcum powder. So I've used the shower to shower for years. I usually get a two pack. In fact, I've got another one down in here if I get to it. But anyway, I could not find this anywhere other than online. And online, they just wanted so much more money. Like even at Walmart, they wanted like $10 or something for it. But if I went to the store, it was only a few dollars. So anyway, I gave up on my hunt and I ended up getting baby powder for my next powder. Do they not make, make talcum powder in stores anymore? Or just is it someplace in a weird place? Anyway, shower to shower sport. I love the scent. It's just kind of helps dry you off and stuff after a shower. Sometimes when it's hot, you still kind of feel sticky. So it's just nice and refreshing. So let's see, we have got, I don't know if I've got the matching conditioner in here, but I've got Madison Reed. That's the hair dye that I've been using for a while. And I get the shampoo and conditioner every now and then. It's got, just got a really nice scent. It reminds me of the Christoph Robin scent that they have in there. So anyway, this is one of the shampoos. I usually go through two conditioners to every one shampoo. Alrighty, we got Scentsy in here. So I'm just going to grab a few and hold them up. So we have to saddle up. And this is kind of like a men's, kind of like a men's aftershave, kind of a musky smell. I didn't really like it as much now that Rick's not here. But anyway, I had a few cubes left. So I thought, you know, I'm going to use it. So this one was Strawberry Champagne Truffle. Yeah, I know this one has my name all over it. It smells like strawberry and wine really enjoy that one. It's a nice summer fragrance. Now this is QMS and it's called Lip Line Corrector. And I've got a couple of these through the years, through different boxes. And I think it's like 130 or something. It's got a high retail value, but I, I've never had problems really with my lip lines. So I just always gave them away to people. But then someone said, I forgot who it was. But anyway, she said, you know, you don't have to give it away. It's just not for that. You can use it for under your eyes and crow's eyes. So crow's feet. So that's what I did on this one. And it just kind of popped up. And when it was nothing in there anymore, it just nothing came out. So anyway, this lasted a long time. If I ever get it again, I will use it again. I loved it. I would never pay 130 some odd dollars for eye cream though. Alrighty, so we've got another Scentsy. This one is Petal Pals. And it just it smells like a nice soft floral scent and honey. So love that one. This one was Shimmer. Really nice soft feminine fragrance. Love that one. This I would have got probably in an Ipsy. It was Tower 28. And it was a daily rescue facial spray. And so I did kind of use this as like a kind of setting spray after I uh, put on my makeup or if I didn't wear makeup and I just kind of feel like hot and muggy, then I would kind of spray that on and get a little bit of relief. I use this Freeman, this Hawaiian black salt peel off mask. And I think I got this about two years ago from Ulta. There was this one, there was maybe like a strawberry one and it came with a spatula. So anyway, did enjoy using this one. Sometimes I, I really love the sheet mask because it's so easy and convenient to use. But sometimes I really feel like I need to really kind of clean out, deep clean my pores, things like that. Uh, 
Scentsy hand soap. Oh, I love this one, Luna. This one was one of my first fragrances that I got from Scentsy. And I had put it um, in my warmers, the wax cubes, not the, not the hand soap. But um, yeah, so I had put it in, in my warmers and um, one of us, I'll say, we know who it was, um, felt his uh, arteries closing up again ended up going to the hospital. I came home like five in the morning and I think we probably left about eight at night. I came home about five in the morning to get ready to go to work and uh, the wax cubes had melted and oh my God, I came in the house and it just smelled like heaven, like freezer and like white flowers, things like that. Luna, it's one of my favorite, favorite scents. I love that. Alrighty, laundry soap. So this is the laundry liquid from Scentsy. This one is Jammy Time, one of my favorite scents. Again, it's got like lavender and things like that. It's just really, really a refreshing, clean scent. Love that. Kind of running out of space in my trash barrel here. We got some perfume in here. It took me a couple of years to go through this. Love the, uh, I, might, I might not even throw the bottle out, but I finally went through it. It was uh, Carolyn Herrera. And I know they got different fragrance lines. Uh, some are red or whatever. This one is the blue one. And I had got a thing from Ultra, one of those cards, and you kind of like rub it, and it just really smelled really nice. So I ordered it, did not smell anything like the cards, but I mean, it smelled nice. It didn't last long. I mean, they talk about designer fragrances, and I mean, and this was expensive, but it didn't last more than two hours, and it did not smell like the sample. Alrighty. So this would have been probably Scentsy. It was... Um, fourth ray night dew it was a hydrating sleep mask anyway i did use this it was nice and thick felt really nice going on and i'd put it on maybe like an hour or so before i went to bed just so it wasn't tacky when i went on my pillow but anyway loved using that i'm really not sure what box this one came in it's midnight sky alchemy and it was a rosemary and pine bath salt and some people would probably like the scent. I think it made me smell like I was in a basil spaghetti sauce or something. I mean, it made me hungry, but it wasn't really refreshing. I finished one of my Lancers. Lancers one when I first decided I wanted to get into skincare. Um, and I had seen this on QVC and yeah, I love it. So I get this, it's like the cleanser. It comes with a polish, they call the polish, and that's like an exfoliator and then a moisturizer. I love using this. I have it on auto delivery. I end up skipping here and there just because I get all this, these other things. If I did not have all these other things to use, I would love to use the Lancer line full time, but it is expensive. So I like using this sparingly to kind of make it last. All right, this knife was another toner. Probably got this in Ipsy. It was called Tight and Toned. And it just has this little pump. It comes out like a foam. Focus, please. I'm saying please. Uh, yeah, so it comes out like a foam. Didn't notice anything great about it. I even tried using it under here. Yeah, it toned nothing. Um, it was okay. I used it, but I wouldn't go out of my way to buy it. If I got it in a box, I would probably use it again. And, oh yes, I'm a secret girl. Can I tell you a secret? Yeah. Ended up using, I'm going to put this trash barrel on the floor because it's getting kind of full. Went through this lipstick. I thought I might have two in here, but if I find another one. This was Milani, and I probably got this a few years ago. Picking, probably picking up a prescription at uh, CVS or something, and took me a while to use it. I did go in with my lip brush to get every bit out. It was a uh, nice and soothing. It was a nice color for me. I would probably buy it again if I could remember what the color was because it's kind of worn off on the bottom. All right. Oh, Sensi. Atl Atlantic Air. I, oh my gosh, I love this one. It just, just reminds me of going to the beach and going to visit my brother um, in Beach Haven um, on Long Beach Island in New Jersey and just oh my gosh we would sleep out on the deck of it was his in-laws place and um yeah I mean they had plenty of beds inside there there was like they rented out the first floor they lived on the second floor and then the third floor was just all bunks and things when guests and things came yeah but yeah 
when I went, I wanted to sleep out on the deck. I just wanted to hear the ocean all night, feel the breeze. And this is what this one reminds me of. One of my favorite scents. And I think I'm doing good tendon wise. I think I'm less than 10 minutes. So this was another toner. And I don't know if this was Ipsy or if it was Glossy Box. It's Grown Alchemy. And it was toner. It was a nice amount. I'm thinking it was probably the Ipsy Glam Bag, but this was a really, really good amount. This lasted quite a while. I would be happy to get it in another box. I don't know what the MSRP is for a full size, but if I got this as a sample or it was in the chance to add on, I would get it again. All right, let's pick up some of these masks because these are all over the place. So we got uh, shampoo and conditioner sample from Madison Reed. So, you know, I dyed my hair at some point. And these are different face masks that we got. This one was one that I recently got from Timu. So it looked like a butterfly. So it went over your eyes and then it had the uh, butterfly wings or something that went like down over your lap, laugh lines. Really, really enjoyed this. It had a lot of serum that I used all over my face after the mask came off. The mask was really diff delicate took me a while to kind of get it on without ripping it but yeah I've got more of these I'm going to enjoy using them and we've got face story in here we've got stuff from Timu in here we've got some ones from Style Dana in here so just really really nice masks I enjoy using these sheet masks went through a thing of Colgate and even though I was not happy that this was like one of my choices, actually in one of my Ipsy boxes for choice two and choice three, there was all yucky choices and both of them had the body wash in there from the refreshments. So lesser of the evils, I did get it. I did enjoy it, but did I, if I wanted to get the refreshment line, I would buy it or I would put it in one of my add-ons. I really didn't appreciate it. Kind of like them throwing it in my face. I would have rather had a nice skincare item, if that makes sense. All right, this was um, ooh, a collagen eye mask. This one probably would have come from Ipsy. I think I got uh, maybe a, a box of like five or something. So anyway, I'm at 12 minutes. I've got more things in this box. I've got two grocery bags in my laundry room still. So we are going to do those on another Wednesday. So I want to thank you guys so much for stopping in taking a little time with me and let's bring Mr. Hand back. Let's bring nothing back. See if he will behave this time. You are a naughty boy. But anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to spend with me. I hope you guys go out, enjoy the rest of the week. Take care everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Be healthy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much and we will see you in our next video. Love you guys. Bye-bye.